Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to reset controller settings on Steam. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So first thing that we need to do here is we need to go ahead and open up Steam. Now from our Steam account, what we need to do first is we need to access our control settings. So at the top left of your screen, click on Steam here, go to settings and on this pop up here, look for controller. Now under controller, what we need to do is we need to ensure that all of the external gamepad settings here is actually disabled. Now also, if your controller is turned on, make sure to actually turn it off or disconnect it from your PC. Now once you've done that, you can go ahead and close up this pop-up here, close Steam here, and at the bottom right of your screen, click on the show hidden icons, and from here, look for Steam, right click on Steam, and just click on exit Steam. Now if you're unable to do this, you could do it via your task manager so hit on Control shift escape on your keyboard and from here go ahead and search for steam now once you see steam here go ahead and click on it and just click on end task now once you've done that or you've closed steam here the next thing we want to do is we need to edit some files on our pc so go ahead and open up file explorer here and look for the c drive now under c drive go to program files times 86 and from here, you need to look for Steam. So just scroll down a bit, open up Steam here. And from here, you need to go to config. So go ahead and open up the config folder here. And you need to look for the config.vdf. So in this case, right click on config, click on the option that says open with. And from here, choose notepad. So if you don't see notepad here, click on more apps and you should be able to see notepad. Now in this case, let's go ahead and open up notepad here. Click on OK. And from here, what we need to do next is we need to basically search for a keyword. So in here, you need to press on Control F. And from here, search for SDL. Now here, go ahead and click on Next. And if you don't find this one, make sure that you actually click on somewhere here. Click on Find Next. And from here, you should be able to see the SDL underscore gamepad bind. Now in this case, you need to highlight everything after the uh, quotation mark here. As you can see, we need to highlight that as well as the section here that says web storage. Now in this case, go ahead and erase this one. Click on Control S to save your changes. And from here, you could go ahead and open up Steam here. And from there, you could go ahead and edit other settings that you turned off on your control settings. Now from here on, you could go ahead and start up your controller and start using it as you would. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.